there's a constant negotiation. I mean, just because the kids have different interests, different things going on, there's just going to be a negotiation. What can we do? What, how can we do it? Negotiating what are the potential downsides of, of anything. It's really interesting being clear about defining things or defining things in a different way than is typically done. And, and it doesn't take on that sort of bureaucratic sense of like, we're going to define something forever and, and, and be done with it, but that it's something that can change and evolve as the situation changes and evolves. Um, yeah, I find I mean, that, that... We, do, you know, we do have the, we have all this fencing equipment. So we yeah we came up with a specific agreement we don't actually we don't call them rules we call them agreements okay because what we have is more of a social contract yeah nice so yeah the the agreement is that you can't really take out the any of the fencing equipment unless it's part of the class yeah that makes sense because then it's it's by definition there's you know gonna gonna be some kind of structure formal or not, uh, you know, there's going to be some kind of structure of how this is going to work by calling, you know, because it's a class. Yeah, yeah cool. because they are, you know, they are dangerous things, foils and epes. This is the Agentic Schools podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world, where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.